We want to catch up now with a Washougal woman whose animal rescue has made her a reality star. Her name is Amanda Geise. Her nonprofit is called Panda Paws, and it's the setting for the Animal Planet show called Amanda to the Rescue. Tomorrow night, it's back for season two. This is where he actually has the injury to his jaw right here, and you can see that he actually lets me touch it. Um, hopefully, we don't have to go in and actually plate his jaw. Hopefully, it's just really growing on its own. Oh, the story of the mini pit bulls recovery oh. is just one that will be featured during the 10 episodes of season two. Amanda, so happy to have her here in studio, along with the adorable Groot. <laughs> and Groot's story will be featured in season two as Absolutely, well. Absolutely, He's yeah. had a hard road. He's had a much difficult uh, last two years, especially over the last year. It's definitely progressed and gotten a little bit worse, but he still has a great quality of life. He's not in any pain. A lot of it is just that he doesn't have neurological control due to his birth mm. malformations. Mm. He's so sweet. Well, Congratulations on coming back for season two. How has the exposure on Animal Planet changed things for Panda Paws Rescue? Well, I think not just Panda Paws Rescue, but I think for animal welfare and general education in general, it's been a major platform for that. Obviously, for Panda Paws Rescue, it shows the globe around the world what we do for major medical special needs and hospice. But I also think that it really does put animal welfare issues on a plethora of levels out there in the public, and it teaches people how they too can be a part of the solution and not the problem. I know that uh, part of the show and, and your fans will see are some of the life changes you have gone through. Um, I read you lost more than 30 pounds, but I know you got sick as well during filming. Yes, I lost the 30 pounds, a little over 30 pounds before I got sick, so it wasn't from getting sick. I got really sick during filming. Um, we were doing an eight day, 11 state, 3,000 plus mile journey to pick up the very first dog that was special needs in Atlanta, Georgia. Then working with Tia Torres from Pit Bulls and Parolees at the Villalobos Rescue Center in Louisiana, through Texas, New Mexico, all the way up back to Washington with a bunch of special needs dogs as well as our hitchhikers for our rescue partners. And I actually ended up getting really severe pneumonia. I had to go to the hospital. I think I ended up in the hospital. I thought it was New Mexico, but my film crew says it was Arizona. <laughs> wow. I don't it's remember those blur. states. Wow. I had 105.9 temperature. Wow. Yeah, I was very, very sick. And it really shows what happens in the real life when you're on the road. You don't yeah. just get a stop because you have animals. That filming you have schedule is The responsibility is a lot. you still mm -hmm. have. You know, you were telling us about how embedded the crew becomes in your life and do they live with you in Washougal? We do have a production house in Washougal. Um, on top of that, a lot of our, our crew is local this year. Um, but it's really interesting. One of my film crew guys came back to film with me just the other day and he walked in my house and he's like, oh my gosh, it's like I'm coming home for the first time again because they pretty much spend the majority of every day with me 12 to 22 hours mm -hmm. and so it's almost like we live together. And what a beautiful lesson for your son and daughter. I know they're helping yes. you now as well. Are they part of the show? Yeah, they've been a part of the rescue their whole lives. They don't know any different. Mm -hmm. However, this year at age 15 and 17, they've really stepped it up. In wow. fact, they do their own transports. They go cross country to get animals. Wow. Um, when I'm gone, like in Louisiana, they step up to the plate and help out a lot more. So. It's, you know, the Louisiana thing is going to be really exciting because we team up with Tia from Pit Bulls and Prolies on a special needs animal. And that's one of the really cool episodes I'm excited for. I'm also excited for my children to really show that they too can do this yeah. and kind of lead the way for other absolutely. kids. Absolutely. Will you all be watching tomorrow night? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> tomorrow night, season two of Amanda to the Rescue is on Animal Planet at 10 o'clock. Congratulations. Yeah, on thank you so much. Huge thank you so much. And all the best to Thanks group. to Groot Absolutely. As well. <laughs>